of the evening. This fight is proudly brought to you by Dominance Guardian Services. It will be fought under MMA rules. 77 kilo weight division, three by five minute rounds, and they are fighting for the IKBF MMA Victorian title. Your referee in charge of this bout is Mr. Ignatius Isolides. Firstly, in the blue corner, trained by Chris Shen and Philip Lay, a team nemesis. Last night of the way, he came in at 76.4 kilograms. He's originally from Ireland, but now calls Windsor in Melbourne home. He's wearing all black stuff with white writing. He has had 15 fights. Ladies and gentlemen, Dennis Kelly. And now in the red corner, he's trained by Ed. He weighs 77 kilograms. He hails from Lane Warren. He's the current Victorian MMA champion. He's had four fights, four wins. We were in Lone Jack Shorts. Ladies and gentlemen, Nick Van Jones. Here we go boys, uh, the IKBF MMA Victorian title on the line, Dennis Kelly from Team Nemesis, 15 fights, former Irish champion, taking on uh, Nick Banjo Patterson, and hasn't he got a crowd following here? Oh yes, has he ever, and he's a very proficient uh, mixed martial arts man, Nick Patterson, he's uh, got now had about five or six bouts, I think he's just about undefeated or close to it. And, uh, yep, four fights for four wins, Stephen. Yeah. Very, very good. This will be a tough technical fight. Uh, Dennis Kelly, uh, very experienced uh, with the, the Brazilian Jiu Jitsu. As I said, former Irish champion, has fought on the cage fighting championships up in Sydney for a couple of times, taking on Bernardo Treco. Very experienced, good, very good grappler on the ground. And he's got Chris Shen, Australian champion, in his corner, and Phil the Vaginator Lie as well. You love that name, don't you, Johnny? The, the Vaginator. <laughs> The, the Vaginator. <laughs> Here we go, go to the ground first up. And up. Don't really know what that means, but I like the sound of it. Yes. The Vaginator. There's a story behind it, but we won't be able to know what it means. Uh, <laughs> yeah. And that we just have to clear the uh, ringside commentary over there. We nearly had fighters on top of us a moment ago. And the boys are now back at the centre of the ring, and Patterson on top of Kelly, uh, pushing down with the left hand on the, on the forehead. Nick Patterson, so side control. He's got the arm under the uh, back of uh, Kelly uh, and trying to push down with that left hand. Patterson will try and get Kelly's back flat. So Dennis has got the ankle lock on. Yeah, because uh, when uh, Patterson gets in the position, a bit of some uh, fisting oh, fury. Ed in the corner. Oh, no point commentating when Ed's there. He can just commentate for us. Yeah. Well, I'll tell you what, Ed will lose a kilo tonight. to <laughs> barracking. <laughs> Kelly now on the bridge trying to get out in a sort of a position. Whoa! Oh. Tempted axe kick from a standing but position Dennis, there by Nick Dennis, Patterson. Yeah, but Dennis has got the leg lock on. Also, I could have been described as a stomping heel in the my vernacular. Yeah, good work by Nick Patterson there to get out of it. As, uh, yeah, Dennis, he Dennis got the ankle out of that. Oh, oh, yeah, look at him. He's working that. Oh, he's he working get the foot. Oh, he's working the foot. Oh, uh, uh, Patterson's in pain. Dennis Kelly got the ankle lock. He's looking to roll it over. Yeah. Oh, he's a tough boy. He's Dennis Kelly absolutely going to work on that ankle and foot. He's going to twist those toes up and push those ligaments uh, through. Patterson's working those fists. Oh, beautiful pinch punching power. Good technical fight here from both boys. Oh, oh. twisting throw. Beautiful work. Oh, these boys are just absolutely coup de gras, top of the range. Here tonight. This is great stuff. The best of mixed martial arts here at Chelsea Heights, put on by the Bugamic boys. Five stores promotions. Kelly, magnificent build on the lad. Obviously, the elbows are there, but uh, Dennis, you can, you can just see Dennis just pushing down. Oh, great stuff here. Kelly on top there, trying to get some fistic fury going, but. You can, you can, you can hear, hear Ed calling out to Ignatius Mr. Leeds to stand him up, but the boys are working. Yeah, they don't have to stand him up, no. Uh, I think Ed, Ed wants his man to stand up, but how can he get out of that hole? That's a legitimate.
bit of a move in Max Martial Arts. Yeah, good Anderson's work. Anderson's got to try and kick out. Good work by Dennis Kelly there, just throwing the odd punch into the rib cage of Nick Patterson. Ed is yelling at Patterson to get up, but he can't get up. Oh, look at the Kelly working away here. And the Patterson tries to respond with the right hand, but uh, not much effect there. A good action there from, uh, from Nick Patterson. <laughs> Referee tapping him out. Boys, little two boys. Oh! Patterson wants to get him down and get that elbow drop into him. Into the scot. Interesting is that Nick Patterson was dropping the elbows in above, whereas Dennis Kelly wasn't before. So. And that's where he was happy for that to happen. Once the Miss Lady's got them up, he wanted to get uh, Kelly on his back. Kelly very strong to uh, stop Patterson from pushing him all the way over so he can get the uh, punches working. Good moving work by Kelly there on Patterson. Patterson is not able to get much power going here at the moment. Right hand in by Patterson. He punches away at the Kelly. Oh, good, good strength there by Dennis Kelly just to... Once again, he's going for that foot and ankle. He wants to work that ankle over with those ligaments. He wants to stretch them out. And the boys get tapped out again. Oh, oh spinning elbow there by Nick Patterson. Oh, he's got a few moves, Pato. <laughs> That's the end of the world. Yes, the oh, oh, the crowd absolutely <laughs> loving this fight. Yeah, but a very evenly matched contest, this uh, Dennis Kelly, no slouch whatsoever. Not at all. Very strong lad and very proficient, very skilled and uh, as you said uh, before, John said the mixed uh, as much the Brazilian Jiu Jitsu champion. And we know how good the Brazilian Jiu Jitsu boys uh, and girls uh, have been in their fighting over the last five or six years. So we're very, uh, very impressed with Dennis Kelly's fitness as well. He's fighting this one at uh, 76 kilos. He fought up in Sydney at 70 kilos. Gee, and he was looking very good then recently. Yeah, that's but, uh, he's more comfortable at this weight. Yeah, Dennis just showing his, uh, his strength here, taking Nick Patterson down. Yeah, Dennis Kelly just working those short punches into the rib cage. That was Buck and Elbow. That was what, what, Ed was what calling out. <laughs> well, I interpreted that as something oh, else, Johnny. Big crossing elbow there from Dennis Kelly. <laughs> Gotta be careful how you say that when you're yelling out Buck and Elbow. <laughs> Patterson just countering with a little downward elbow of his own across the head of uh, Dennis Kelly. Dennis Kelly very much into the, to the fitness and motivation along with Phil Lyon. They've got their own website www.combatsportsdiary.com.au Get on there, it's a great training regime, you can record everything. Yeah, this is good. Ignatius oh. Missalidi's doing a terrific job there in centre ring. Yes, yes. Big jump in right. right. for Nick Patterson. Patterson's going to the town of Kelly. He was wobbled as he went back onto the ropes. Striking in here at, uh, in the 
corner calling out to me. To Mick Banjo Patterson. Dennis, just biting his time, he was rocked by that jumping knee. I don't think he can do much for that knee there, Kelly. Now he's uh, trying to apply a hold there on uh, Patterson, maybe trying to throw him, or is he. Uh, both boys at the moment with both uh, their strengths working against each other. Now we hit a 45 corner men of Nick Nan Banjo Patterson just calling out elbows, elbows. A slap from the Patterson. Another head slap. He can't seem to get the Kelly's able to stop him from getting any uh, repetition punches working when he's uh, on his back there, Kelly. Dennis doing well to, to negate the, the punches of Nick. Did very well to do that. Oh. Patterson getting a bit frustrated. Frustrated, Patterson. No, I think what happened there was uh, referee Fraser's missile He tried to step him up, but Dennis wasn't letting go. Oh, and then yeah, who brought who down there? I'm doing Patterson and Kelly. One and half of us on the other. Punching away as Kelly there with Patterson on his back. Trying to work into that rib cage again. Not much uh, energy being applied in that tackle. Yeah, from our commentary position, Stephen, those little short punches pretty much just token. From where we're sitting, just token punches. Not a lot of power behind those. Yeah, yeah. And they, uh, they, well, neither boy can get themselves their opponent in the position they wanted them. Come on, the second round. <laughs> oh. And in the second round as well. Nick Benjo Patterson, Dennis Kelly. That was pretty good. Here we go, the title on the line, and uh, Nick Banjo Patterson with a massive crowd support. <laughs> crowd on their feet here in the third and final for Nick Banjo Patterson. Yeah, good takedown, side control there. Nick oh, Patterson yes. looking to rain the elbows down, but Dennis just uh, covering up, guarding up. Flew into the fighter as soon as he got into the ring to start that third round. And they're working way intently on Kelly. Yeah, Kelly using strength. Oh, Kelly bleeding from the nostrils. Oh, oh body, body slam. Crunchy slam. <laughs> did well there to negate that, though. We locked the legs around as uh, Nick, Nick was just about to drop him, so it did, uh, took away a lot of the force. Kelly now has got to extricate himself from this desperate position. Nick Patterson looking to go to side control again. Trying to get that leg round. They put a bit of pressure on the, uh, perhaps the, uh, it's too late now anyway, the referees come in on the calf, but that didn't work. Patterson now, oh, spinning uh, back kick, a half measure job. There's a Kelly back to the oh, neck. Oh, got, got the choke on. That's a good one. Kelly it. looking to sink the choke in nice and deep on Nick Patterson. Nick looking to roll out of it. You can hear his corner telling him to knee. There's an exposed ribcage there. But yeah, he got the knee in there and uh, he's broken loose of that headlock. Could have been dangerous for Patterson. Kelly needs to get, try and work on that leg again and the foot of uh, Patterson get him in that hole. Seemed to be in the stronger position he's had in the fight was when he's worked on the ankle ligaments of uh, Patterson. Yeah, and he just hasn't had the opportunity to apply that oh, uh, lock once lock again. There he, goes he might get it now, though. There he goes. Yes, yep. he, he must have heard you, Stephen, because <laughs> he's gone for that foot and ankle again. Oh, now he's got on top of Patterson. Patterson's got the leg on the rope and they'll have to move them to the centre of the ring. Which, which is in a good position for Dennis Kelly because he had a very good mount there. Patterson won't be happy with this. They'll have to put himself in the position where he's going to get hammered here. So Dennis Kelly now with the full mount position. Patterson's raised his head up to avoid those punches and elbows. Kelly now thumping into Patterson. Pounding away as Kelly. Oh, absolutely oh. unloading now is uh, Dennis Kelly. Oh, and an elbow as well. Oh. And a big right. Right hooks. Oh. Right in front of the to start arching his back and try and push Dennis off, which he's doing now. But Dennis, he's got a very strong him off. round and pound. He's his energy to flip him. Kelly scoring points here. The judges. Kelly's round so 
He's won a lot of shots there in that position, Stephen and Johnny. Oh, yeah, he's taking all the leather. Oh. He can't get out. Fight, but that would have to be one of the most action-packed, yeah. entertaining fights in a long, long time. Uh, without a shadow of a doubt, because uh, at various times of the fight, each fight had an upper hand. Uh, at various stages, uh, Patterson did fight back resolutely in that last round, but Kelly had to do a lot of punishment. Last thing I think Dennis Ladies wants is to have the big jumper on the team, Nemesis jumper. Of action, the judges have made their decision. It's a split decision. Judge number one. Calls the fight. 29-28. Red corner. <laughs> Judge number two. Calls the fight. 28-29. Blue corner. <laughs> Judge number three. Calls the fight. 28-29. Your winner. And new 